It's the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Welcome to another production here on the Open Mic Broadcast Network and the Mike Prince Show. It is our mission to try to bring you some news you could use. Today is no exception to that rule. Follow me on X at the Mike Prince Show. Subscribe to our YouTube channel with the Open Mic Broadcast Network and visit the website obnradio.com for our 24-hour stream. With all that being established, let us jump right into today's episode. Well, shots were fired out of the Alcorn camp late yesterday evening, making the announcement that there will be a press release, not a press conference, but a press release by 12 noon today, Central Time. Now, you can read into that one or two ways. If you take the, I guess, more of the latter part of it. The 12 noon release is a rather late release time. Normally, you'll have a release about 10 a.m., but they're choosing to go at 12 noon on today. If you were trying to read some tea leaves within that, That would tell me that Coach McNair is heading to Houston. That's just pure speculation at this point. Because normally, as I mentioned, you have your releases start around 10 a.m., sometimes as early as 9 a.m., but definitely by 10 a.m. to announce what would be considered positive news but we will see what the end is going to be meanwhile it has been very quiet out of the Texas Southern camp nothing has been said one way or the other now back to the reservation for a moment there were reports stating that when word broke out last Wednesday that Coach McNair had accepted the offer from Texas Southern. He texted his crew and staff members on Thursday stating that he was still the head coach at Alcorn. There was a recruiting weekend at Alcorn this past weekend. And some were saying, well, that's probably an indication that he was going to stay at Alcorn. Or could it be that he was letting the recruits know, hold your hat just for a second. There's been a last minute change. I'm still interested in you, but it's going to be at a different location. All that's going to drop today. We said last week that we thought today would be the day of reckoning, if you would, on the whereabouts of Fred McNair. We'll keep you posted right here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network, in particular on our social media account X at the Mike Prince Show. We'll flip it out one way or the other. And speaking of flipping out, the Prairie View A&M University men's basketball program had a non-conference contest against North American Stallions on yesterday on the campus of Prairie View. They were victorious by the score of 92 to 61. You can go to the YouTube channel and check out our little non-conference coverage on that with Greg Johnson doing the play-by-play. Going to be talking to the guru later on this week about basketball play throughout the Southwestern Athletic Conference and get his feedback on other news and notes that are going on throughout the Southwestern Athletic Conference. I am going to exit stage left for right now. Tick-tock on the clock, trying to see what's going to happen one way or the other. Well, something's going to happen on the reservation. Something's going to happen in Houston, Texas. Stay tuned with us. Until the next time, you guys be blessed, and we'll see you on the other side.